Hey guys, and welcome back. I think we have sound. Yeah, we do. To Clock Tower 2. Or Clock Tower 3, depending on where you're from. Um, yeah, so... We appear to be playing as Alyssa. Uh, we've come home, and things are going a little bit crazy. We found a dead doll. Um... Well, a dead doll. That's a little bit redundant, isn't it? We found a doll covered in urine, um, scattered about the place, and a gun as well. And apparently, somehow, we have a new personality. Alyssa has gone to sleep in her own body, and we are now Mr. Bates. So, not really sure what's going on with that. Oh, and something about an amulet as well. Interesting times ahead. Actually, let's go and examine the toilet. So I'm wondering if, as Mr. Bates, if we can examine all the parts of the doll, perhaps? I'm not really sure. But we know we're Mr. Bates because we seem to have this glowing aura around us. <sighs> not really sure how the mechanics work of it, uh, on this, but... Someone's leg. Right. Cool. Thanks, Mr. Bates. It certainly is somebody's leg. I guess. I was hoping Mr. Bates was going to have a little bit more for us than that, but... I guess not. Um, there wasn't anything in there, was there? Okay. So what I did do is I read a few reviews on this game um, from back in the day and yeah they, they definitely kind of took it apart a little bit ah we can go through here a bit okay now important to remember I didn't read a guide I just read reviews so I'm still not sure what's going on or what to do oh we haven't been in here before now we do have the drawer key. So I'm guessing it's for this drawer. There's a hell of a TV there. Holy shit. Yeah, drawer is locked. Okay, cool. So it looks like now we're playing as Mr. Bates. We can now go through every room in the house. Which is kind of strange. I found a pistol. Got another pistol. Okay, I thought we might actually... Why did you leave it where it is? But left it where it is. Okay, so... There's another gun there for reasons. That's cool. Everything's normal here. Well, okay, cool game. Um, hmm. I guess a sweet FA in here. Right, so let's go back to the kitchen. Whilst I trash my mouse and my keyboard. Uh, yeah, let's go back to the kitchen then. So I guess, like, maybe that is the. Oh, hello. Who's on the phone? I guess we can't answer the phone? No. Why would we be able to answer the phone? That's too obvious. Alright, now can we search here? Now we're Mr. Bates. I wonder if he can, like, find anything. No, everything's normal here. Uh, okay, so we still can't go through that door. Alright. What about if we turn the lights off? we turn the light... Oh, we can't actually turn the light off. I was going to say, if we could turn the light off, I wonder if something spooky would happen. But I guess not. So the... F oh, hello. What's that? Actually... Ugh. Huh? It 
it alive. Wow. That voice acting, though. Wow, that is something else. It's Alyssa's amulet. Yeah. So what do we do with that, then? Okay. All right. I don't know what that does. So we can go through here now. Where did this go? I can't remember. This leads into the actual kitchen itself. Okay, now we haven't been here yet, have we? There doesn't appear to be much here, though. Oh, fuck. Oh, hello. Um, oh, fuck. Uh, don't know what we're supposed to be doing here. Okay. Wait. So, that's the protagonist. Or antagonist of this game. Really? Well, that shit. Where's Mr. Anamusha? Oh, she's fucked off. Um, cool. So, creepy, like, ghost doll girl. I guess. That's... Cute. Alright. Well, no scissor man, then. At least not yet, anyway. Um. That was really anticlimactic. Gonna be honest. So full. Well, it's going to be full of uh, your body parts, I guess, if we don't solve this mystery. So we got, like, that's so weird. There's just some stupid little girl chasing us around. It's not really scary, is it? Everything's normal here. Like, there was something really menacing and foreboding about, um... Oh. Okay, I think we just mashed the X button. I think. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Sure. So there's going to be traps. Good to know. So it looks like she's using knives. Alright. So, I mean, I guess we're making progress. I guess. Can we go through here? Yeah, she's nowhere near as menacing as a scissor man was. Oh, what can we do with this? Oh, fucking hell, like everything's alive here. Holy shit. Uh oh. Guess who's back? Back again. Through the door. Through the door. Now, if we go through the door, is she gonna hide? Uh, is she gonna like chase us? Oh, oh! So, like the original game, when you're in like combat mode, <laughs> oh, nice! When we're in combat mode. The only thing we can select are, are things that we can use to defend ourselves. That's great. We just, like, lunked a kid over the head with a pot. I I approve of this. So it looks like there's a lot more going on in the environments than there was in the first game. That's cool. 
Um, so we've got the amulet still. There's nothing we can do in here. There's like, I, mean, I guess this fireplace can still be used. Yeah. So I guess we've got to light the fireplace. Um. I don't. I guess now she's after us. Maybe some of the events have changed in the rooms. Like, I know there's a gun there. Can't really do anything with this. There's nothing in there. There's nothing. Oh, what's here? What is that? I wonder whose attache case this is. I don't. I don't know. Is that relevant? Okay. Right, okay, so there's somebody's case. I don't know why that's important. I guess we're going to go back upstairs, maybe? I mean, I suppose we appear to be Alyssa again. And there's more luggage there. Let's go back upstairs. Let's see if we can find Philip again. If he's about. Uh, seems to take quite a while for our health to come back. But it did in the first game as well. So I suppose that's normal. So there's a little creepy girl chasing us around this house. Ah, we're back in the toilet. This is where we found the gun. There's Ooh. something written here. It says, help. Okay. Well, I don't know why you'd write help there, but sure. Um, hmm. So I think that's all that's in there. So that's where we got the gun from. I guess it's just a case of going back through the rooms and seeing if anything's changed. So Philip's not here still. Uh, I guess we can search that again, but I suppose everything's just normal. We can search that, but I, yeah, everything's normal. Yeah, I guess that's gonna like fall on us. <gasps> yep. Oh, not only did it fall on us, it like completely disappeared. That's cool. That's just a cupboard, I think. And she's going to be like, everything's normal here. Either that or... Oh! Oh! We found a first aid kit, and we appeared to, like, use the first aid kit as well. That's curious. Not sure if using that first aid kit was a waste. I don't know. So this just leads out and around here again. Next time she comes after us, I'm going to try and use the gun. Ah. Now, as Alyssa, we can fondle this. I'm going to kill you. Is that so? What the fuck? Um. Uh. Use the sword! Use the sword! Very slowly use the sword. I'm going to kill you. Yes, I'm sure you are. Oh, uh, hello. Evening. <laughs> right, you little bitch. Have some of the- Whoa! Wait, 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 wait. We can't use the gun? Can we not use the gun? What's... Okay. What's the point in the gun, then? Uh... Oh. What the hell is the point in the gun? You're not going to try and hide behind it, are you? Wait, you're Stephanie? You know this kid? 
I'm sorry, I missed that. Alright, so where was that idol thing then? Can we, like, pick it up? I guess... I guess not. So, we have flying uh, idols that are trying to kill us. That's cool, I guess. So, this place is tapped out then. Definitely nothing in here. And the little girl that's trying to kill us is Stephanie. Okay. Not sure what Stephanie's beef with us is, but I'm sure we're going to find out. Well, let's go back through here anyway. What do you make of this, Alyssa? What the hell's going on? What is this? Oh, yeah. This is the the room of doors. Doors and doors and doors. Oh, hello. What's that? Statue? What is this? It's possessed. Okay. Ouch. It has some kind of power. <laughs> Spooky. Well, that didn't. What's that scream? Sound good. Uh, I don't know. Can we like shoot that? Oh, I can't touch it. But why? I don't know. Maybe because it's possessed with some kind of power. Right, who's screaming? I'm guessing that's Philip. Has Philip been murdered by Stephanie? Probably would be my guess. Now, he was in the room with the TV. Let's go see if we can find him again. Unless he's, like, moved. So we can't shoot her with the gun. Like, what's the fucking point in that? Is it because we, like, know her or something? No, I guess he's not in here. Alright. Hmm. Well, let's go back into the room of doors. So I'm guessing we have to do something with that statue. Maybe. Maybe we have to be, because it's glowing. Do we have to be like Mr. Bait again? That might be worth investigating. But I don't know how we become Mr. Bait. Do we ha is it like a story-based thing? Because I know you swap and change between the two, because I read that in the review. How we became Mr. Bait when we examined that last time. Ashley! Hmm. Okay, so we can go out here now. I don't know if we went out here last time. No, we didn't. Ooh. There's another room there. Um, I don't know if we've been to these rooms, though. Is this just like an alternate way in? I don't know. Ooh. Stephanie? Yeah, Stephanie's at her old tricks again. I get oh, shit. Who's that? Michael. Who's Michael? Michael? Don't be so scared. Stop! I'm so confused. So who's Michael? Michael too. Uh, yeah, I guess. But who is Michael to us? Is that like a brother? Found a key. Bedroom key, okay. I'm guessing one of the bedrooms was locked? I can't remember. 
Oh, I think I remember actually. Right. Oh, baseball bat. Very nice. There's no one left to use the computer either. Okay, but one odd thing to say, there's no one left to use the computer. Do we need someone to use the computer? Can we not like can we not play Doom ourselves? Alright, well let's get out of here. Where does this lead? So Michael's dead. And the other girl's dead, and I can't remember her name. Okay. Bedroom key. So let's get out of here. I'm trying to think where that locked room was. We're still on yellow health as well. It's taken a very long time for our health to recharge. We can't can't get down there. That was the bathroom. There was nothing through there. There was a locked door down here somewhere, wasn't there? Uh, oh, can we leave, actually? The door mysteriously won't open. Well, well, well. Actually, let's save it, because I have saved it for a little while. I don't know what the penalty for death is. Yeah, yeah, we know there's shoes there. Alright, come on, Alyssa. Let's go. There's nothing in those two rooms. Yeah, there was definitely a locked door out here. I can't remember where it wasn't there. Oh, we can examine the clock now. Oh, are you serious? Really? Um not really sure what we can Okay. You again. Right. Can we Can we actually do anything with her? No, I guess not. Oh. Okay. Narrowly avoided death once more. Yes, very funny, bitch. Oh, okay, so when we escape her, she will randomly exit one through one door, I guess. Right, let's try and get away from her. Can... Oh, shit, okay. Oh! We need to knock her out somehow. Um, if we go back out, back out to the balcony, there are more plants that we could probably throw at her. God, it's so slow, like how she moves. Oh, I guess, ah, bollocks. Oh, hello. Well, I guess we're going to clout her over the head with this thing. All right, you bitch. Open wide. <laughs> oh, that's, that's not going to get old, is it? <sighs> we are so injured, though. Okay. So let's go back down again. Maybe our health doesn't recharge in this one. Because there are health kits. I wonder if that samurai guy. That armor. Can we use that? So it looks like there's some weird... Oh, the phone's going again. But we couldn't open, uh, answer the phone last time. Oh, now we can. Ah, we can answer it as... Alyssa, I guess. <laughs> I'm going to kill you. Uh-huh. Or so you think. <laughs> I'm going to kill you. Yeah, you said that already. 
Why are you exiting the room? Let's go back into the room. Don't know why she exited the room. Okay, cool. So can we examine the clock again? No. Let's go... Well, I suppose we can go in either of these doors. Ah, the door's locked. Okay, that's the one we need then. Bedroom key, I guess. Not sure why this isn't... Ah, okay. So no, it's not the bedroom key. So that isn't the bedroom. All right. Noted. Stop. Stephanie, stop, please. Uh, okay. Where, where did that come from? I mean, we've got like three doors here to choose from. Okay, so it didn't come from in here. Yeah, this voice acting is proper bad. Like, <laughs> it's not even funny bad like Resident Evil. It's just bad, bad. Alright, that one's locked. Okay. Is that the bedroom key? No. Okay. Have we opened that door yet? Guess did we use that key? Think so. Oh, here we go. Um. But Catherine, run! <sighs> Hurry, run! <laughs> oh, dude! Don't come out. Uh, what? What? <laughs> I guess we done fucked up, guys. <laughs> or did we? <sighs> what the shit is this? Wait, is that like one of the endings? Because we died. <sighs> you know, some games just really don't age very well, do they? Um, I don't know. I'm kind of enjoying it in a very camp, incredibly cheesy, shit way. But like, I mean, I don't know what happened. Did we uh, did we just die? And if so, do we get this every time we die? Luckily, we can skip this. Ending rank is M. So okay, we've already got one of the endings. Of which, by the way, that there's thirteen. I'm kind of glad we saved it now. Clock tower. So, whenever we end. So, whenever, like, we die. That's it. Game over, man. That's. kind of annoying. Ending list. Okay, so we've got all these endings. Kind of tempted to go for them, but kind of not as well. Hint list. Let's have a look. Alyssa and Bates encounter different events. If you find yourself unable to continue, first change personalities by putting down the amulet, then try again. 
by putting down the amulet. Can we put the amulet down whenever we want? Interesting. Alright guys, well I'm going to end this one here because we are on half an hour anyway. I'm guessing... No, oh, thank God for that. I thought it was going to say no data then, as in we can't load it. I was like, what the fuck? Now, <sighs> let's just try something. I know we should be ending the video, but let's just... Hang on, before, hang on. Right. So... How do we... Right. I wonder, can... Can we use that statue to somehow change? Uh, it was in there, wasn't it? At least I'm sure it was. Yes. Can we do that? I can't touch it, but why? Okay. So... Hmm. So how do we change to Mr. Bait, then? It's like, oh, yeah, you know, if you need to change characters, just change. But you can't. So, because it says put the amulet down. I mean, it says it like it's something trivial, like, oh, you could just put the amulet down anywhere. But you can't. Oh, so, we haven't had the event in here yet. Uh,. All right, let's see. Do we need to trigger the event here? Let's just go through here. Was it? It was that. No, that door's locked. Ah, oh, that's the point. We've still got locked doors yet. So. Stop. Stephanie, stop, please. So, can we go through this door first? No, that one's locked. Yeah, that... Ah, yeah, that's the only door we can go through. Okay, well, let's try that again. Because, I mean, obviously we have to go through there. I mean, can we sh shoot? Can we shoot her? Oh. Oh. Catherine, run! Hurry, run! I'm way confused. Oh, don't come out. Yeah, and then we just get stabbed. Okay, well, I'm going to leave this one here, guys. I am confused. I think I need to find out how we switch to Mr. Bait. Hmm. That was frustrating. Uh, unless... I think this game's going to be a massive fucking pain in the ass to go through blind. Uh, I might actually have a little squiz through a guide. Because this game, it, I think, it, if it's anything like the first one, it's going to be proper freaking cryptic. 
Um, so yeah, I might just have a little bit of a squeeze because like I don't even have a clue what I'm doing. Like, I don't know how to change to Mr. Bait or anything. Um, hmm. But it's interesting. It's entertaining in a very deliciously cheesy way. So anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.